Currency wars typically involve countries jockeying for weaker exchange rates to make their exports cheaper and more competitive to other countries. In reverse, countries want stronger currencies to fight inflation, make imports less expensive, and boost their spending power overseas. That is the backdrop that we saw in the 1980s, which led to the historic Plaza Accord, an agreement among major nations to weaken the US dollar by jointly intervening in their currencies. The backdrop of the 1980s appears to be making a comeback now. Inflation is at a decade high for most countries, and the dollar's record strength is diminishing the value of money everywhere else. In the UK, the pound has lost about 20% of its value, and it fell to a record low after the government unveiled a fiscal plan that investors fear will put the country in a worse financial position. What's next? Watch for signs of countries intervening in their currencies. Japan has confirmed that it's already doing this, while China is stepping up efforts to boost its currency. In the UK, the Bank of England is under pressure to support the pound, but its firepower for doing this is a fraction compared to its major peers. Thank you.